In this video, I'm going to teach you how to verify Capital One card for Apple Pay. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly verify the Capital One card that you want to add to your Apple Wallet and consequently Apple Pay. So as you might be aware, you can initiate this process by opening the Apple Wallet, tapping on the plus sign, and choosing to add either a debit card or a credit card. You will then get the options to input all of those details and make sure that you can verify the card. Once you are done inputting the card number, expiration date, security code, and so on, you will be asked to verify the card. Now, usually, most cards will give you plenty of options, such as a phone call, an SMS, an email, and so on. However, the Capital One card in particular can be quite tricky. If it tells you that it is unable to verify itself, or it doesn't give you any of the options, the first thing to do is to make sure that you have the Capital One mobile app. The mobile app is crucial for verifying the card. In fact, it is going to be the primary method to verify your Capital One card on Apple Pay. So all that you have to do is download the latest version of the Capital One mobile app. If you are unable to download this app because you are outside of the US, then sadly there isn't much that you can do. The best course of action would be to acquire something like a VPN so you can access this application. Like I said, it is going to be crucial to have this application in order to verify your card. Then just sign into your account and as long as you leave the application running on the background while you attempt to add the card to your Apple Wallet, you should be prompted with the option to verify it through the application. So all that you have to do is make sure that you have the latest version of the Capital One mobile app. Something else that you can try is to switch from Wi-Fi to cellular data. And as long as you do this and you once again keep it running on the background, it should give you the prompt to verify the card using the app. If it still doesn't work or it tells you that the issuer does not support this card, then sadly there isn't much that you can do. We simply have to wait until Capital One updates this issue and fixes the card for everyone. I hope I was able to help you on how to verify Capital One card for Apple Pay. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.